Well, the good news is this island actually has a population, not. Nah. So we can start looking into things like timber production, which is going to be absolutely essential since obviously we kind of need to, uh, you know, we need to, we need to make sure that there is a way to build things around here. That's, that's kind of important. So let's do, I guess, a lumberjack's hut there. Let's do a sawmill right across from it. And let's bring some roads sort of up and around like this and straight through the middle. And they're obviously going to need a warehouse as well. So we can throw a uh, we can throw a warehouse right there, honestly. Not super efficient, but it will give us everything we need for the area. And what we can go ahead and do as well is just build a few of those. Not that many of them, but it's something. And we have some wood production. So this island is actually going to be able to more or less sustain itself at this point Huge. which is beautiful news so let's have you can i can i get that uh, trade route gone and i want to bring the boat back over here so that'll do some good things for us uh this island here is actually doing all right one of my routes has a major issue yeah that would be the fact that it doesn't have uh it doesn't have any boats on it let's get rid of that route completely Interesting that Beryl has, Beryl has a scary, Beryl has a scary number of boats. Like seriously, she also just has a scary time. Like there's so much going on here. There really is just so much going on. She has all these sewing machine factories and the concrete factories and just everything, everything, everything for Beryl. It's, it's nuts. Uh, and then if we want to do the same, like if we want to upgrade this, we need canned food, we need uh, fur coats, we're probably going to need more sausages, we're probably going to need more, well, we need a university as well, there's so much that we need. There is so, so much that we need. Uh, now let's see, you're missing goods currently, you are missing steel. Interesting, I'm wondering, at least I'm assuming that, uh, yeah, steel production isn't very good right now. Uh, now, let's see. Iron is... Actually, okay, so iron's fine. That's interesting. Charcoal's kind of fine as well. So, I guess what that means is we probably want to look at getting more furnaces. Because we're not producing enough steel. So, let's throw a furnace there. And that'll hopefully start producing a good bit more steel. Because we do, we do have more than enough of those. So, more steel production is going to be a beautiful thing. Uh, variety theater. Now, this is something that they were complaining about at one point. They wanted a, uh, they wanted a, a variety theater. So, I mean, we can get one of those. Absolutely. Let's throw it maybe down here. Maybe we get rid of these farmer's houses or at least upgrade them. I think we will. I think we'll, we'll upgrade those as well. Just so that this is a bit of a nicer looking area. Then we can throw a variety theater back here or kind of anywhere in here, really. Um, I'm kind of liking the look of... Uh, oh, I don't know. Where can I put this thing? I kind of like the look of that corner. So let me actually just demolish those and throw a theater right there. It is not your lucky island, mate. Get out of here. So yeah, that kind of works. You may not find a new island either. And yeah, that'll hopefully cheer them all up a little bit around here. And give them something to uh, to look forward to going to. Let's see, we can't upgrade this yet either. We need more steel beams, which I'm assuming are probably not doing great either. Where is the factory for these? Right there. Missing goods, missing steel. And then, yeah, we have some steel beams, but uh, not many. An explosion? Uh, well, that's bad. That's, that's bad. Let's just fix all of that. And get that back up and running. This one doesn't look too scary. Fine, settle the island, mate. Whatever. I don't care. Go go settle wherever you want to settle. Whose is this? This is Willie's place here. Beryl owns the entire island. He is... I would say probably on par with where I am. Maybe? Also, I do have a church, right? I, hope you may still teach me of your I do believe I have a church. I have one. I should probably get another one. Then up here, your island is 
decent, I suppose. And then I guess this is your new island. Fair enough. Mm. Well. Then over here is, of course, my new island, which I guess I can go ahead and start building on as well. So let's do this. We can build those. Build this. Uh, we can build fire station. And yeah, that looks all right. So that gives us a bunch of workers out here. I guess what we should do is we should really look into getting the... Uh, getting the red pepper farms it's ready to go so let's see if we can do that oh what have you got for me yeah we're not gonna be doing any of that let's have uh let's have this let's have uh have this and publish there we go all right of course so red peppers definitely a thing we want let's do that and no not that so how many of these can we get 108 so if we were to do three rows, what is that going to do for us? Apparently, exactly 108. Alright. That's fine. Let me do a few of these. Because what I'm thinking I'm going to do is just put a big... Just a big row of them, basically. Because we do want to transport these back to our main island. So let's do... Let's do five of them. Quite expensive. I think they're 2,000 each. So actually not that expensive, to tell you the truth. Um, but we'll do this. I like that I actually haven't technically built these yet, but I can at least lay out the blueprints for them. So there we go. That'll be our farms there. We can do something like this for our road. We can do our warehouse just at the, at the end of that road, I guess. Let's see. Is that actually in the right spot? That actually is. Okay. Okay. So yeah, that'll work. That'll be our warehouse there. And then they all need connected to uh, to down here. So there we go. That'll give them a connection. This is going to need more planks. That'll happen in time. In fact, we should probably look at more production for this stuff over here. So 58% isn't much there. Let's do... I don't know. Let's go back here, maybe? What is this? So coal and copper... And iron. We should probably do a lot of iron mining out here and move it back to the main island as well. Zinc and coal and iron. That might not be a bad idea. Let's uh, let's maybe do that, actually. So, iron mine there. We can actually build that as well. So, give me an iron mine there. Uh, and give me an iron mine there. Let's... Now, those are actually going to need... Let me see. That actually needs workers. That's a bit of a problem. You know what? Let's let's get those out of there. We're not going to bother with iron mines just yet because we can't actually get them to work. So, that was kind of a waste, but no big deal. Uh, now, let's see. You guys are going to be connected. Let's build this warehouse so that we can actually go ahead and start getting red peppers. This warehouse will probably need upgraded as well, but we'll not worry too much there. But yeah, that'll give us red peppers, and then I guess what we can do is set up a trade route to take peppers back to the main island, and then on the main island, we can start doing canned food. Uh, I guess a cattle farm right here as well wouldn't hurt. So let's do something like that. Let's do a cattle farm there. And it's got four fields that can go around it. So one, two... Three, four? That's not great looking, is it? But whatever. We'll do that. We'll throw another cattle farm next to it. And do one, two, three. Think of it as oh, four there, I guess. Character. A destruction quest. Sure. A tiny crack of Destroy the frigate. Lives. Consider it done. Consider it done. Give me these four boats. Let me have them go out here and destroy that. Engage. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go blow something up. Can't help but notice that only one of you is moving. That's a bit of a worry. Can I get you all moving over there, please? If you wouldn't mind. Because I'd like to get this done sooner than later. I don't want to be in a situation that we were in before where, you know... We, we blow the thing up, but we have no time left to uh, do anything about it. 
So let's get the boats out there. Ceasefire has ended. In fact, we'll just move the boats out and we'll let them sit there for a second. What is this? A little bit of fighting going on down there. Interesting. Beryl chasing someone out of the region by the looks of it. Classic Beryl. Always up to no good. Oh, let's see. Let's see. Is that the boat over there? It is. Let's keep going. I think we've got this. I'm pretty sure my ship of the line is having trouble keeping up, but whatever. That's not too big of a deal. There's the boat there. It seems to be coming back towards us. Let's go ahead and sit there. It's coming straight for us. Are we all going to be moving into attack range here? Is that going to be an option? Can I get you three to attack it? There we go. Oh, it's going to suck to be them. Or not. Really? Can you not enough to call it go attack it? Do you not have guns? Do you not have guns? Really? All right, the Enterprise does. Line of battle. Clipper, do, do Clippers not have guns? I, I guess not. Did I build a bunch of clippers instead of? Oh. There's a solid possibility that I did. Interesting. Okay. Well, that sucks. All right, let's go destroy it anyway. We got this. No big deal. There we go. We do a lot more damage than their boat does. And boom, there we go. All right, so let's get one of the clippers to go pick that up. If they wouldn't mind. And then we'll take that to wherever this is. Right there. All right. Let's go down there. I suppose. I'm a little annoyed. I didn't realize those boats didn't have guns. Genuinely a little bit annoyed by that. I thought they did. Genuinely, genuinely thought they did. That explains a lot, though. <sighs> oh, well. It's, it's not that big a deal. We can uh, we can deal with it. Let's go ahead, then, and build these. And get those going. That'll give us a decent number of peppers. As for the cattle farms, we can do... We can do something with those. Let's see. So, um, cattle farm. Maybe right there. And uh, we'll do a bunch of fields, just like that. All right, so that'll be, yeah, that should be pretty good. I think we can build these ones as well. So there we go, a bunch more cattle farms. And those are hopefully going to have pretty good access to warehouses, right? Yeah, they absolutely do. Okay. So that seems pretty good. Have we delivered this, by the way? Uh, yeah, hand in the quest. The There's a bit of money. Not bad, not bad. Just say the so, this ship can be sold at a harbor. So, if I was to bring this boat down here, a fire broke up. can I sell it? Wait, we have a fire? Oh, in the new world, we have a fire. The people celebrate your Oh, a city festival? Really? Oh, not bad. They're very happy with me. That's nice. That makes a change. They're usually miserable. I like it. I like it a lot. Okay. We do own all of this, right? Yeah, we do. Okay. Okay, not bad. Um, can I buy shares anywhere? Because I know I know Beryl owns like all of this. What about this island? Does Beryl own much of this? Ooh, they're quite expensive, the shares on that island. What about the new one? They're not worth much. Oh, let's do it. Let's buy a share. Sure, let's do it. Let's buy a share. Kind interest. Is that she, as she's mean? not very happy about that, but that's fine. I now own a little bit of little bit of that island. I don't really know what that does, but I now own a little bit of it. And that makes me happy. So let's see. 
Uh, let's go back to construction. Let's look at canned food. What else do we need for it? We need an artisanal kitchen, which we cannot afford to build here. Um, and then an iron mine as well, technically. Now, the interesting thing is iron mines would actually be really useful on this island. So I might have to work towards getting workers, which means they need fish and it means they need clothes. So... I mean, I guess that's a thing we're going to have to do. Let's get two fisheries there. I think we're going to have to slightly adjust that cattle field there. So let's see. Can I get another one anywhere? Doesn't look like it. I think we're just going to bulldoze you completely then. That's fine. Let's bring this over. That'll give us some fisheries. And then in terms of clothing, I mean, that's going to be sheep farms. Also, where's the fire here? There. It seems to have gone out, though, so that's fine. All right. So, sheep farms. Let's let's look into some sheep farms. So, we'll go right there. And we can do three small fields. Then we'll go next door to it. And we'll do three small fields. Uh, and then we'll do next door to that one. And do another three small fields. All right. Off of that, what we can do is throw in a has been framework knitters. And we'll throw a few of those in. Just like that. And then maybe do more cattle fields behind those. And more sheep farms and all that stuff. Just to make sure that, you know, this is all going to be working as well as it can. Because the idea is very much to, at some point, uh, move all of these resources and all this stuff over to... Um, over to uh, the the old island. So having this all in one space, I think it's going to be really good. I think it's going to be really, really good. I'm also thinking I'm probably going to double up the sheep farms. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and around. So let's throw a, another bunch of sheep farms just in here. So one and two and three right there and we can just go around these doing the same old thing and this is absolutely Fire slash hopefully gonna give us enough uh wool to get these all running really nicely so that should be pretty good that should do some pretty good things for us that'll give us all the clothes we're gonna need uh that'll hopefully give us the ability to upgrade a lot of these and we probably also want to look into a bit more water on here. So let's do that. Let's get a lumberjack's hut. It can go, let's say, about there. And let's say, about there. With maybe a warehouse right at the end of them as well. So, small warehouse right about there. Alright, that should be pretty good. That'll just double up the production of lumber really nicely. And then I'm thinking that some of you should be, yep, absolutely upgradable. Not bad at all. Uh, we'll do that in a little bit, though, because I think what we're going to want to do first is this and just get a higher... Not be. Let's let's get a higher population on this island before we start upgrading the island. Because uh, the population's not that high just yet. It's It's not quite where I'd like it to be. But it'll get there. It'll absolutely... Absolutely get there. Let me see, let me see. So, I'm actually going to publish that. That's fine. There are no negative sides to it whatsoever. Also interesting, my money is fluctuating quite a bit there. It occasionally goes into the negative and then bounces back up. So that's going to be something to, uh, to definitely keep an eye on. Definitely going to be something to keep an eye on. Uh, let's upgrade the small trading post there to make it a little bit better looking to handle more things. And uh, let's actually do the same just here. Because I didn't realize that was a thing I could do. And let me see. So I built, what, clippers? Yeah, I built clippers. They don't have... It's frigates that I wanted. So we have a boat of mine down here, right? Can I sell it? I, I can. Anyone for croquet? 8,500 for the ship. Yeah, sure. Let's, uh, let's, let's sell that boat. 
And let me send my other two clippers Attention, down that people. way. And we'll sell those as well. And then we'll build frigates in here. So let's do one, two, three, four, five, six. Five of them, I guess. So we'll do five frigates. And that'll be fine. Actually, can I Just keep one of you? Because one of you as a transport ship is going to be pretty useful. In fact, let's set up a trade route. So we want to go from there to there. We want to load... Uh, let me see. We want to load beef. And we want to load... We're in the presence of a virtuoso. Let's see. What do we want to... We want to load the, uh, the red peppers as well. Then unload both of those in Druidstone. So that should be fine. Uh, we'll accept that trade route. And away it goes. Um, let me see here. A special visitor awaits at your harbor and wants to become a part of your city. Do you give them permission? Yes, I suppose we do. So, let's see. Special visit. The specialist wants to join your city. Yeah. I don't see why not. I don't know if there's a downside to that. I, I have not got enough experience in this game to know for sure. So, we'll assume everything's fine there. Um, I'll tell you what as well. Where's so the the discovery is my flagship. It actually can do damage. I might you know what? I have a So where are you? You are down here. I'm actually gonna switch things out for a second here. I wanna open my, my trade route menu. Um I would like to cancel the new trade route. The triangle I'm going to add the solo to that. And I'm going to take the discovery off of it. So there we go. So that's going to keep going. So the solo is one of my clippers. Um, the enterprise and the discovery need to meet up there. Because they can both do damage. And then with the frigates, we'll be able to do even more damage. So that's that's going to be pretty good, I think. So we'll keep all my uh, we'll keep all of my my damage vessel my, my warships essentially uh doing their own thing now let's see let me go and let me start to upgrade all of you and all of you i suppose and we are starting to get a pretty good population around here still need more wood before we can uh upgrade you know actually start upgrading things here but i'm not too worried about it not too worried at all and then we only need a couple of workers as well. Because what I want to do is I just want to get the iron mines here. That's really all I want to do. So let's rebuild those like so. Then we'll bring some roads sort of like... Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's go to there with that road. And let's go to there with that road. And we could probably do with the, uh, we could probably do with a small warehouse just up here. And then possibly a uh, small warehouse just all the way down here as well. So a couple of small warehouses. And then once we have the wood to upgrade things, we will start to get enough workers to uh, actually run all of this, which will be a beautiful thing. An absolutely beautiful thing. If I find there is anything wrong. I'm also wondering, are we looking all right with this trade? I think we are. I, I think we're producing a decent amount. So that's fine by me. Uh, let's see then. So upgrade. We can upgrade a few of these. Shortage. There is a shorter of worker, shortage of workers. That's a thing that I'm well aware of. Um, I'd very much like to upgrade an entire row of these. We can upgrade those ones. Let's let's do that. That's fine. And uh, upgrade you. Every then to upgrade you, we points. need four planks. So there we go. All right. So we don't have as much of a shortage of workers around here anymore, which is beautiful. So we should see the mines get up and running, which means we probably want to slow things down for a second. We want to go to my boats. Um, the solos. So this one. So we want to open the trade route menu. Uh, we want you to start loading up with iron. So that'll be fine. 
and we're going to start moving the iron back to the main island. So that will hopefully be a good way to get more resources in the main island so that we can go ahead and on the main island actually I think start working on canned food. Oh wait, no. Hold on. Do we want to we Oh no, we do. We make this back here. So the artisanal kitchen gets made on Druidstone. And then the cannery gets made here as well. Okay. We can do that. That's not too big a deal. Let's do... I don't know. Where do I want to put this? Sometimes you just have to take a cudgel I actually have no them. idea where I want to put this. Could put it out here, sort of on its own. But I kind of like stacking everything in one space. So let's throw it there. And then the cannery... I guess right next to it or sort of behind it. So let's throw the cannery there, I suppose. And I might throw another warehouse out here just to make sure that we're not completely overloading the area. So let's just do that sort of thing. We can upgrade it a little bit. We can actually upgrade it again. Uh, this one, for example, needs an upgrade. We'll upgrade you as well. So there we go. A couple of large warehouses right in the middle of all of that. Uh, this right here has beef and red peppers on the way. And then this is going to need goulash and iron to come in to start making canned food. And then once canned food starts getting made, we should see these guys a little bit happier. Uh, we are going to probably need more bread and more sausages, though. So that's going to be a thing to look into as well. But this this is working. Like, I'm happy with this. I'm genuinely quite pleased with this. Uh, we could upgrade another few of the houses. We can't upgrade these ones right now. I guess they probably need another market. So, where can we do that? I guess we could do one in there. So, yeah, let's... Uh, let's, let's cancel a few of those. And let's throw a marketplace right there. With a uh, little road there. And then I should be able to upgrade you four. So there we go. Interestingly, my income is not very good right now. We are possibly back to losing money, but I'm sure that's no big deal. We have all these boats here as well, which looks fantastic. Let's move them up there. And then this one, which is... In the works. I'm going to cancel those two, though. I think the ones we have are probably fine. That does look nice, though. Let's see. This is, uh, this is all barrel ships who are... Hunting down a pirate frigate, I assume. Fair enough. Fair enough, barrel. You keep doing your thing. Ah, uh, what about this island? Do I still own part of this island? I do. I could purchase more. I absolutely could. I only get plus 14 from my share income on this island, though. I'm assuming buying all these different shares is how Beryl has managed to, uh... You know, build all of this and make all this money. Your city has grown uglier. Good lord. Uh, why has this grown uglier? Have we got, like, rubble and wreckage over here? Yeah, quite a bit of it, actually. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's rough. Can we, like, let's, let's, let's renovate a few of these and get them back on their feet. All right, the fire's out. Let's just fix all of these. There we go. Yeah, this place is having a pretty rough time. So, you used to be a luthier back in the day. If you bring me wood, I can make one for everyone. There you go. We'll absolutely do that. We'll have you make us a guitar. There you go. Alright. Wait, you gave me what? Paco the Stubborn Donkey. Thank you? I guess? Sure? I, I mean, yeah. Thanks, I suppose. That's fair. Um, so rum. Do we have much? We do. We have a decent amount of rum. 
Although we still can't do a whole lot with this place because we can't make tortillas here. That's a pain. I'm assuming some of these other islands are going to have tobacco, pearl, cotton, all that stuff. Yeah. Wait. Who's this? Oh, it's a pirate frigate. Okay. So I wouldn't actually be able to build anything there. Beryl has this island as well, which is great. Uh, she's got coffee. She's got cotton. She's got oil wells, interestingly. Uh, and then that's, I guess, the little the little town there where she has a hospital and everything. Interesting. Up here, we... So can we just not do corn in any of these islands? And this one's owned by Willy, which is not going great for him by the looks of it. With my own hands. Like, he doesn't look to be having... I mean, he's got he's got a little settlement, but it seems like it's not going great for him. And Beryl with this island. Like, look at this. Good lord. She knows how to rub it in, doesn't she? She knows... Like, Beryl... Good lord. She's got gold mines and everything. Ay, yeah, yeah. All right. Wait, what are you doing? Assigned to expedition. Oh, you want to go on an expedition. Not enough to call it okay, store. well... What if I was to put... I don't know, can I put guns on there? I, I don't know what to do here. I mean... Force is likely hunting certain rations... I mean, I can give you some food. It's not much. I can give you some rum. Uh, rum, will, rum will cheer you up. There you go. And clothes, I guess. Sure. Let's start the zoological expedition. That seems like a solid idea. Away you go. All right. I am probably going to regret doing that, but uh, whatever. That's probably fine. I I am so... Oh, I'm nervous. I'm nervous about Beryl because I know that there's a solid chance that one day... She may try to kill me. Uh, she may one day get sick of me. And just looking at her fleet... I mean, I'm not certain that I uh, would be able to do much against that. She even has a gunboat in there. Wait, what is this? A steam shipyard? Are you kidding me? Barrel? Really? You've, you've got a... Oh, my God. Okay, we we need to... We need to step things up a little bit. We've run out of is guys. what I'm thinking. We really need to step things up a little bit. I'm also aware that all of my, my steel is still just... Like, we have enough of, uh, we have enough iron, we have enough coal, we just don't have enough steel. So, another steel works is gonna be needed. So, let's throw one there. And we could throw one there. I don't think I will. I think I'll throw one just over here. And hopefully that'll be enough to, uh, get everything going nicely there. That's a pretty big hopefully. But, regardless, it's uh, still still a hopefully. I'm really, really hoping that we can get those doing amazing things. Because steel seems to be letting us down. Also, our budget is pretty bad at the minute. I think we need to upgrade a few things around here. I think we're going to need more farmers. The good news is we could. I feel it reflects the time. Uh, let's see. New edition of the newspaper. Rum shortage. That's fine. Give me more money instead. And give me this. Publish. Uh, let me see. What I'm thinking we could do is some farmer houses like this. And we can just... We can just build out. And uh, that should... At least boost the the population really nicely, right? So a bunch of farmer houses in all of those spaces. Could's another row of them there. I'm not gonna bother. 
you are generous with and uh yeah that should boost the income a little bit that'll give us a few more farmers we can probably get away with upgrading a few more houses as well so that'll boost the income as well i would imagine and here's hoping for some good things off of all of that this is kind of cool looking though but I mean, it's a big grid but i can't really do curves in this game so you know it, it doesn't matter as much also town hall please do we have anything we can put in there gives more happiness absolutely absolutely give me more happiness right there and then i guess this what is this My brief candle when she's not at church giving the von trip children music lessons my daughter maria likes to go singing and picking that in the hills i do so hate to interrupt her lessons with the children but i need her here at the workshop A okay find and collect I fear I maria i'm assuming that's maria there we go equipped and trade union more productivity all right so he didn't we didn't want to interrupt the lessons but still did that's fine uh maintenance cost increased chance of fire last productivity higher i sure why not we'll throw that in there that'll be all right and then you have a quest for me as well there's been another accident with the tools we left laying around someone's gonna get killed one day build a kiosk so we can store them more safely will you uh build a newsstand wait what build a is that an artisan thing it is sure i guess little newsstand right there there you go and then you gave me an alpaca for the zoo okay why did you have an alpaca just lying around i mean i'm not judging i'm just genuinely quite curious but that seems like a weird thing to just have laying around but to each their own i guess let's see can we do like can we do some nice hedges in here so that's a corner one that's your hedge end all right that's your i guess t section of hedge let's do some like hedges i guess we'll do one two three and one two three and then like a an entrance so something like this that looks all right it looks i guess better than what we had so let's do one two three and three there like that and I like this. I actually, yeah. That looks so much better for that central area. I really I'm quite pleased with that. Uh, let's destroy some of this as well. Get some more decorations in here. Let's just make this central chunk of town look a, uh, a little bit better. We can't really throw a garden in there, but that's fine. Uh, we have memorial statues. We have garden benches. I mean, I guess a statue could work. Or like a little news stand thing or that even. Gazebo gardens are certainly a no-go. Uh, let's do some benches, I guess. So they're all sort of facing the same direction. Um, can I get the one with the... Yeah, there we go. I guess that looks kind of okay. It looks a little bit strange, but no big deal. Uh, let's throw something like that right yeah i like this it's it's simple but it's a nice little bit of decoration yeah i like that a lot okay we need to start doing these all around town at some point then we absolutely need to start doing these all around town at some point because uh i think that looks pretty good like you zoom out and suddenly it's like this really nicely detailed street so yeah we're gonna have to be busy Let's also see what the artisans want. So they need fur coats. So we need, oh, interesting. So we're gonna need to get some cotton. Interesting, can we do hunting over here? 
we can. So we need to start bringing some cotton back from the new world. Well, that's a bit of a twist, isn't it? Didn't really expect to have to do to do that anytime soon. But okay, we can make it work. Uh, let's throw a hospital up there real quick. And let me throw a hospital there. And uh, I don't think we have room for any more of them, to be honest. We absolutely do not, so that'll be fine. We'll build those at some point. Probably just not any point soon, but that's fine. 